Uh, hijacking a Star Blaster on Xandar, consorting with a Centaurian delinquent, impersonating a Nova Corps officer. Ugh. I want a clean slate for my whole crew. Rocket, Gamora, Groot, and Drax. Ha! Ah, Nova Prime won't be happy about this. But if that's what it'll take, we can do it. Okay, here's the situation. We tracked Thanos to this Kree planet. But when our fighters engaged, he decimated our fleet. Without your help, he'll kill us all. We're no match for him. Half our ships are already gone. All right, space cops. But you're gonna owe us big time for this. You will be compensated, Star-Lord. Please hurry! Oh, and now Groot's on fire! Groot's on fire! Peter! <laughs> I am Groot. Oh, Groot says thanks. Wait, if you're all here, who the hell is flying my ship? Track. Do not distract me, Star-Lord. Thanos is here. Today, I finally slay our nemesis. My dead wife and daughter shall have their vengeance. I have longed for this day of dead. Dreamed of Enjoying myself. Yeah, well, I'd enjoy you shutting up, okay? Off to a great start today. I am Groot. All right, guys. Let me show you how it's done. I am Groot! Uh, no. No! That was absolutely not fun, you stupid log. Okay. <clears throat> not my best effort. Not my worst, though. Uh, uh, any worse and we'd all be dead. Where is the other green one? Uh, wishing we had better seatbelts. Still breathing. Mm -hmm. Oh, 
Bruno! Get me down! Get me down! My sweet, precious little baby! There's an infant on our ship? Well, that can't be good. Where is it? Where is it? Pig! Get down here! I mean, up here! Whatever! Stupid, stubby little arms! Man, it is nice being so tall. Yes, I get it. You're the friggin' chosen one. We're all gonna be red paste in a second if you don't help me. <clears throat> Careful with that. <clears throat> My baby, give it! Come on. <clears throat> Woo! <laughs> Another nanosecond, and we all would have been atomized. Still looks like it'll blow up to me. It sure ain't no toy. We get pushed around by a lot of dangerous jerks. I built this bad boy to push back. <laughs> ain't she a beaut? She's still a little unstable. Still, if you had something that dangerous on board, you should have told me. Us. You should have told us. I told Groot! So this is how I die. The Mad Titan arrives. He is heading towards those ruins. Looks like the Nova Corps failed. It's up to us to take him down. Just the five of us. And that gun. <laughs> Thanos, through there, I smell his evil stench. That door is not gonna budge so easily. <laughs> yeah, it will. Okay, so this gun ain't totally, you know, operational yet. And it only has one shot. But think of it as a feature. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, you can't harness enough energy to atomize a biggish moon or smallish planet without some drawbacks. You know, Rocket, that... that seems like a major design flaw. So's your face, Quill! Man, that was terrible. <laughs> Hmm. Now, let's see. I am Groot. I think I see a way over. Tread lightly, Star-Lord. Thanos must not detect our presence. I'm not gonna tread at all. No, no, that was... 
was uh, totally part of the plan. Definitely did not almost die. Whatever you gotta tell yourself. Oh no. What happened? Did you find the Nova Corps? Yeah, um... They're all dead. Hang on. I'll find you guys a way through. Eh, worth a shot. How's it look from over there, Peter? This thing is really solid. I'm gonna need something heavy-duty to punch through. Well, keep looking. We're counting on you. Stand back. I'm gonna try and push it down. Be strong, Star-Lord. Hey, wow, that's working great. Hey, Rocket. You need something from me? So, is that fancy gun of yours ready yet? You can't rush perfection or nanomolecular weaponry, so no. Man, I broke the hell out of this thing. Wonder who you were. Sounds like Thanos is already down there. Looks like the Nova Corps made an emergency landing. Right through a wall. Kinda looks like my landing. Ooh. Hey now. That could do some damage. You there? What's up? What's going on over there, man? I found a crashed Nova Corps ship. Right smack through the wall. Ooh. Ouch. Yeah. I think its guns can blast the door open, but I can't get into the cockpit. Check the side. Should be an access override panel. I, uh, might have stripped one of these ships for parts before. Found the panel, but I can't get it open. Yeah, you're gonna need an override chip to access it. High-ranking officers usually carry them. Maybe I can figure out who was in charge. Well, I've got the time scanner. These guys weren't in charge. Drax, pick up. I can hear you, in my ear. So, who do you think built this place? Kree. I can tell by the hideous architecture. I have never encountered more bloodthirsty and nefarious creatures. I rejoiced greatly when they were annihilated. Their uniforms, it's it's kind of hard to tell them apart. Yo, what now? Got any useful info about Thanos? Unfortunately, I do. Being raised by a monster, you learn firsthand of the darkness that lives within them. Thanos exists solely to impress death. To rule the galaxy unopposed. We would be wise to prepare for a battle unlike any other. Bingo! I'd eat you. Got it. Yo, Rocket! Uh, yeah? 
What can you tell me about Thanos? Only one thing that matters. Big T wants to murderize every living being in the universe. He's a simple man in that way. Hey, you guys still out there? Affirmative, Star-Lord. Good. Stand back from the door. Like, way, way back. Understood. Backing away. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. Booyah! This is a Kree temple. They are a technologically advanced species. Strong of body, powerful of military. What is Thanos even doing here? What does he want with this place? Guess we'll find out. I know one thing for certain. I gotta get this thing working or we're all dead. I'm almost done tinkering. Promise. Just a little more calibrating and this baby will sing. That gun better be worth all the trouble. Have I ever built anything less than incredible? I am... That's right. The answer is no. Hey, I think this can take us down. If the controls aren't too damaged... Eh, no big deal, Gams. I can undamage them. I am Groot. And Groot says he's worried we bit off more than we can chew. Ah, why don't you relax, you big wooden baby? We're just going deeper into the old creepy temple. More than I could chew? Ha! Yeah, you put something in this mouth, and I'm gonna chew it. I'm gonna chew it so hard that you- Peter, stop. There. Good as new. The time has come. Either Thanos falls, or we do. On my planet, before a great battle, our fearless leader would rally the troops with his words. Thanos is done terrorizing the innocent people of this galaxy. It's time for payback. Yes. Revenge. Always a noble pursuit. Okay, somebody say something. This is very, very uncomfortable. I am Groot. <laughs> Good one, pal. expect as much from you. Now that I have this, I shall roll through the galaxy like a great wave, crushing the bones of every inhabitant and the civilizations of every planet I pass. Uh. 
Oh, let me guess. It's a ancient super weapon. Or something. The Eternity Forge. Called it! Daughter, you have aligned yourself with such pathetic creatures. I was never your daughter. Then you will die an adversary. Oh, shut your damn mouth. We're done chit-chatting. One by one, you will beg for death. Give me a few more seconds! You don't have any more! My turn! This is for my wife and daughter! You always were the ungrateful one. You're right. Thanks for training me to kill. I'll put it to good use. I know! Gun! I know! You took everything from me! I removed your weakness. I gave you purpose. Thanos! You are a 
<laughs> you have failed. The guardians of the galaxy. You cannot even guard yourselves. The galaxy is mine. Smile, you son of a... No way. <gasps> That's what you get, punk! Thanos is dead! About friggin' time! Tired of looking at that wrinkly chin of his! Guess this relic is useless. Huh. <laughs> but this gun wasn't! Who did? You did! Rocket, you quit it! Did? Yes! Stop it, both of you! Enough! We are victorious. The biggest terror the galaxy has ever known is no more. I am Groot! I... I never thought this would happen. Yeah! What do we do now?
Without Thanos, we might just end up driving each other crazy. I mean, with Drax and Rocket. Even I might have a bit of a temper. Sometimes. Are you kidding? We already drive each other crazy. <laughs> okay, yes. But you found a way to make us work together. Honestly, we all stay because of you, Peter. You're the one who's gonna keep us from falling apart. Uh, wow. Uh, yeah, no pressure. <laughs> Sweet wife and daughter have finally been avenged. I have long dreamt of this moment. And its arrival is satisfactory. They'd be proud of you, Drax. Thanos can't hurt anyone else's family. And that is because of you. I can find solace in that statement. I was not there to save my family before. But now that I have exterminated Thanos, my redemption is complete. I am Groot. <laughs> Groot's totally right. He said Peter killed Thanos. Now you, big guy. Nonsense. Clearly, I got my revenge. Didn't see you pulling the trigger. My hands are too strong. Of course you did, Drax. You killed the guy who killed your family. That's the definition of revenge. Yes. Thank you, Peter. Those are precisely my beliefs. I shall celebrate by consuming this vile swill. Yes, 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 this is the gun that blew a hole in Thanos. But no, you can't do shots on me. Okay, maybe just one. <laughs> Hey, Rocket. So, as I was saying, I built this brilliant, beautiful piece of machinery with my own two hands. I can tell you're impressed by my uh, technological virility. Ain't hey, nobody in the universe can do what I do, especially not any of you chumps. <laughs> you know, I couldn't have said it better myself. My good pal Rocket here, his gun wrecked Thanos. The applause feels good. You know? Maybe I should quit while I'm ahead. Go out on a high note. We've been at this hero business non-stop for a while now. I should just retire and live off all the fame and free booze. Yeah! Woohoo! Yeah! As they say, absence makes the heart grow bigger. Nah, nah, that sounds like a medical condition. You can't leave us, man. We gotta keep the band together. Oh, you guys will be fine. Plus, there won't be any more of my fur clogging the drain. Everybody wins. I mean, look at all we accomplished. Thanos is dead. The galaxy is guarded. Our job's done. Maybe it's time we go our separate ways. Hey, drink maker! I got two hands and one of them's empty. I am Groot. I'm gonna need your help, Groot. 
We can't let Rocket leave the Guardians. I am Groot. Drinking out of a galactic super weapon, I see. Bold. Nice to see you're enjoying yourself. You kicked incredible amounts of ass today. Thanos is all kinds of dead. Yeah, I know. It's been a complicated day. How about a refill? Why not? On my way. You disrespectful human! How dare you! Whoa, 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 man. Don't don't make this a race thing, okay? Humans are people just like everyone else. So you say, Star-Lord. <sighs> Guess not everyone's a fan. At least I managed not to drop this. My hero. I try. Thanos murdered your people. I... I thought you'd be... happier once he was gone. He was a monster, yes. But he was also my family. I can't make sense of it. He was a terrible father. He was the only father I've ever really known. I keep thinking about Nebula. Your sister? I called her that. We both called Thanos, father. He used to force us to fight, to prove who was worthy of being called his daughter. I won. We couldn't stop until there was blood on the ground. Well, it made you strong. You're one of the best fighters I know. Still, it haunts me. Neb stabbed me while I was sleeping, because I won. Imagine how she's gonna react when she finds out we killed Thanos. She loved him, I think. In her own way. It might take some time. But she will forgive you. I imagine I'll have a matching scar to go with this one first. There's a small part of me that wants to see my sister again. But when she finds out what we did, She's gonna lose her mind. She'll hunt us all down. And kill us. You don't know Nebula. Imagine me, but angrier. And enhanced with cybernetics. Yeah, well, what she doesn't know won't come back to stab us. Look, just leave her alone. That would be the safe bet. Besides, I wouldn't mind starting fresh. To moving on. To moving on. Hey, you chubs doing a toast without us? I thought we were a team. To what are we toasting? I built the gun who killed the baddie. The toast is mine. It says so in the rule book. To good friends. Friendship? <laughs> Boring. I am Groot. Yes, I know I'm your best friend. What does that have anything to do with anything? Well, we haven't killed each other yet. Nice work, Peter. Hey! There you are! I've been looking all over for you. Ah, uh, why? We got a big, big problem. Okay. It was not my fault. 
I barely consumed my body weight in that toxic liquid. Hey, I was surrounded by adoring fans. I couldn't let them go thirsty. Oh, I don't care who ordered all the drinks. We need to figure out how to pay our tab. Pete's gonna love my solution. You know I always got genius ideas, right? You need a plan, you go to Rocket. That's the deal. Yeah, whatever it is, I'm sure it's brilliant. Why, thank you. It certainly is. We're gonna sell Thanos' body! I am... That is... not a bad idea. Selling a corpse? How could that be profitable? There are people who would find it valuable. Exactly. And I know just the guy. The Collector. He loves buying exotic crap for his museum, so Thanos, the newly dead Titan, will be perfect. He'll pay you tons of units for that body. These are the kind of people you want to be rubbing elbows with, Pete. Everything they got's a superlative. I love everything about this. And I love you for loving it. Or... we could turn Thanos over to the Nova Corps. They've had an official bounty on his head for years. Plus, it comes with the added benefit of not having to deal with criminals, like the Collector. He's a corrupt thug, bottom line. But the Nova Corps, they maintain peace and order in the galaxy. They have thousands of ships and soldiers. Hey, we're not exactly saints ourselves, Gamora. I'm not judging. There's a difference between us and the Collector. Yeah, <laughs> we're broke. And the only way to get unbroke is by selling Thanos to him. Guys, we just killed the biggest, baddest criminal in history. We shouldn't turn right around and become one ourselves. <sighs> Working with the Nova Corps is the right thing to do. You're being a greedy little rodent right oh, now. as if you're so high and mighty, green lady. You suddenly forgot all the innocent people you murdered for that psycho? I remember each and every one. Not that you'd understand. You do whatever the hell you want, whenever you want. That is an accurate and completely acceptable judgment. Hey, Rocket, cut it out. Way too far. You kidding me with this, Pete? This is why I need a friggin' break. It's Peter's call, Rocket. Not yours. Enjoy staring at my furry backside, chumps. Hey, Mom. <laughs> Had this bag since I was a kid. Used to hold candy. Now it holds... Well, now it holds alien candy. Ah, missed that view. I always knew I'd make headlines someday. Just didn't think it'd be for killing a giant purple tyrant. You, uh, doing all right after last night? The Rodin tried to deny me my victory. But you, my true and noble friend, Peter Quill, stood with me. I believe Hovat and Camaria can rest peacefully now. I really need to figure out what to do with Thanos. Novacor, Collector, thrown into a black hole? That is up to you. He is dead. That is all I care about. You know, I've never asked. Hovat and Camaria. What were they like? My wife and daughter. They were... kind. Brave. True. Qualities I, myself, aspire to possess. Ask me no more of them, Peter. I do not always wish to remember their faces. So, eating your feelings, I see. With Thanos defeated, there is a void inside of me that only these rations can fill. 
All right. Gotta run, Drax. Stay cool. My body temperature is always 125.9 degrees. <sighs> oh, man. Is everything on this ship broken? Well, that's not good. Who did? You did. And about to be someone else's problem. That terminal took a beating in the crash. Still offline. Gotta use the one on the bridge. You come to make amends? Yeah, man. Look, I'm sorry I didn't stick up for you earlier. Yeah, well, make it up to me by selling Thanos to the Collector. So what's up, my main man? How you holding up, buddy? Yeah, my liver's trying to shake me from the inside out. I've never had so many free drinks in my life. Living in a post-Thanos world, on the other hand, maybe it won't be so bad. Some time off would be a welcome change. So, what's the deal with this Collector guy? Might come as a surprise, but the Collector collects stuff for his collection. When he's not running the Underworld, that is. He pays tip-top dollar, which is way better than anything the Nova Corps can do for us. Why do you hate the Nova Corps so much? Those NC jerkwads locked me and Groot up at least a dozen times for bounty hunting, weapon stealing, you know, innocent stuff like that. Hey, come on, a guy's gotta make an honest living, am I right? So, you made up your mind. You're really leaving, then. Look, man, two days ago I was getting shot at. Last night I was getting shots. Know what I mean? We're famous. I gotta take advantage. Step one? Sell Thanos. Step two, fling money into air. You still messing with that thing? Nope, dismantling. Gonna use the parts to fix the engine. Really? Yeah, well, I stole parts from the engine to make it, so I'm just putting them back. I said I'm putting them back. I should get back to it. Oh, and don't be an idiot. Thanos is worth a fortune. Call the Collector. Uh, Groot? Buddy? I am Groot. <laughs> Oh, pull yourself together, man. Listen, you make a mess in there, you're cleaning it up. I am Groot. Hey, Peter. How are you doing? Fine. Staying as far away from Rocket as I can. Ugh, I don't want to let him ruin my mood. Last night was actually fun. Ah, maybe too much fun. So, something on your mind? You still worried about Nebula? No. I, uh... I feel better. Talking it through helped. You were right. I should focus on the future. Hey, what are friends for? <laughs> Stopping one another from drinking too much. We both failed that mission. So, 
You still mad at Rocket? He needs to watch his little tongue. I... may have been too harsh with him. He just... oh, he's so infuriating! Why do you like the Nova Corps so much? I don't really like to talk about it, but I was an assassin for Thanos. I killed so many people for him that I lost count. Tyrants. Innocents. Didn't matter. If you ever hear the ridiculous nickname, the most dangerous woman in the universe, that was me. But the Nova Corps, they turned a blind eye to my past after I joined the Guardians. Being with you guys, making the galaxy safer, it's my chance to make up for what I did. I guess I'll talk to you later. Some advice for you. Don't trust the Collector. You should call the Nova Corps. Okay. Nova Corps. Star-Lord? We thought you were dead. How the hell did you survive? Hardly any of our soldiers made it out. Our fleet was wiped out. What can I say? I'm a tough guy to kill. Huh. I should have known Thanos couldn't take you out. Yeah, speaking of which, I have something you might be interested in. I got Thanos lying right here. Really dead. Smelling up the place. Now, I understand there's some kind of bounty on him. Is that right? You have his body? <laughs> I can't believe it. We'll dispatch some officers to your location. Nova Corps out. What? We could have gotten way more units with the Collector. What were you thinking, Pete? I rolled out the red carpet for you, and you took a friggin' nosedive. Oi, I should have just sold them myself. We need strong allies, not some body displayed in a museum, okay? It's wrong. And weird. 
That's two W words, and that proves my point. Whatever. There. A third one for your stupid list. I'm Groot. Groot says you did the right thing. Yada, yada, yada. I say we totally missed out on a big score. Thank you, Groot. Shut up, Rocket. Fine. You want to suck up to the space cops? Be my guest. But I ain't going with you. Calm down, Rocket. Look, how about we throw in that relic? That'll give us a little extra. <laughs> I guess. Every little bit helps. Ah, oh, come on. Where did I put that thing? No. You. Found you. gonna kill him. Ugh. He broke it, Mom. That doesn't mean it was okay to hit that boy. Violence isn't the answer to every problem. Are you listening to me? But it's okay for him to just break my stuff. Of course not. I imagine he's learned his lesson, though. You gave me this for my birthday. I mean, you should be pissed <laughs> off, too. <clears throat> And what he did was wrong, but... But you, you... Don't just go punching every person who makes you mad. Especially not someone who's three grades above you. I mean... That kid practically shaves. And three years from now, we'll be in the same grade. <laughs> Very funny. This can't keep happening, Peter. I know I haven't been home as much lately, but that's all the more reason I need you to step up and take some responsibility. I know. Then you know tomorrow you're apologizing to that boy. And I mean a real apology. No smart Alex stuff. I'm sorry, Mom. You're right. <sighs> it's okay, baby. You're a good kid. You're so much smarter than this. When you want to be. <sighs> I think we could both use a chance to clear our heads, don't you? What we need... is a little perspective. Sometimes it takes stepping back from your problems to see how small they actually are. Beautiful. <coughs> These last few months haven't been easy. For either of us. But, um... I'm not always gonna be here. I worry about you. You're growing up so fast. Don't worry about me, Mom. I'll never stop worrying about you. You're gonna be around long after I'm gone. I just don't want you to be alone. <coughs> Mom? <coughs> I'm fine, baby. It's nothing. <clears throat> it's just the dust. I know you've got a lot on your mind. But that kid you fought, maybe he does too. Promise me in the future you'll use your words instead of your fists. I will, Mom. I promise. Thank you, baby. What can I say, huh? I'm pretty good. Hey. Oh, great song. Someone with exceptional taste must have introduced you to this one. Uh-huh.
Peter! Are you okay? You've just been standing there, talking to this thing. What did you hear? You called me mom. Huh. It's been hours. Hours? The Nova Corps are here. Okay. Uh, yeah. You look like you just saw a ghost. Something isn't right. I... I really don't know what I just saw. When I grabbed the relic, I... I was suddenly back on Earth. And my... Mom was there. Peter? Your mother is dead. I know. I, I know. I know she is. I just... Somehow it didn't... feel that way. <sighs> we can't keep the Nova Corps waiting. But I do not trust this thing. No way we're selling it. All right. Showtime. Let's go. Thank you, Guardians, for bringing Thanos' body straight to us. We know the Collector was quite interested in purchasing his remains. Probably to put in that hellish zoo of his. Yeah, but I don't do business with people like him. Yeah, and I imagine he offered you way more than we ever could have. <laughs> but know that should you ever need us, the Nova Corps has your back. Once we have verified Thanos' corpse, the bounty is yours. While we're here, I've just got to say, I'm a big fan of yours, Star-Lord. You took out the Mad Titan. Well, of course you are. Who's not? <laughs> <coughs> Narcissist. <coughs> hey, Quill. I don't know what Narcissist means, but I agree with Gamora. Rock it out. Confirmed. Thanos the Mad Titan. Great. We'll take that bounty now, Space Cop. Of course. Okay, once the body has been received by processing, the bounty will be released to accounting. You should start receiving your payment in installments in... six to twelve months. Ugh, I know. Standard protocol. But there's a lot of red tape and paperwork to go through. Oh, come on, man. Help me out here. I mean, can't my biggest fan speed things up a little? Well, <laughs> um, I might be able to pull some strings, but, um, in return, I, I, I have a small favor to ask. Just, like, tiny, tiny favor. Uh, can I, um, <clears throat> um, touch your gun? I, I've always wanted to. It is legendary. Uh... Let's not make this weird. Oh. Oh, oh no, no, I, I didn't mean to make it weird. Mm, I am Groot. Yeah, he says it's very weird. And we're all done here. It's been an honor working with you, Star-Lord. <laughs> Peter Quill. Oh, what now? You have something I desire. The Eternity Forge. All right. The body will be taken to the facility. Oh my god! Whoa! And since Jinzar could not retrieve it earlier, 
I must take it myself. I will not fail you again, Hala. <gasps> Retrieve the relic. Can you actually shoot? Speak, kid. Is that a yes? Ah, just follow me. So incredible! Woo! <laughs> How do you like that? Oh, hey! Get the hell off! Oh. Mine. Ugh. No, no, hey, hey. We have what we came for. We need the ship! The engines are down! It's gonna take a minute! We can't wait! They're getting away! I'm coming with you. There's only one pack. Allow me to fight beside you, Star-Lord. I killed Thanos. I can kill some measly blue warriors. The size of that warship. You can't fight your way through that. Take me, and they'll never even know we were there. Let us paint her ship red with blood from the inside. The fewer people who detect us, the better. You've seen the types of weapons they possess. I welcome the confrontation. Gamora, you're with me. As you wish. Kill all the Kree for me, Star-Lord. If you do not, I shall never forgive you. Looks clear. Let's get moving.
You've been acting strange ever since I found you with that relic. Now you go flying off after a Kree warship? Is this about that dream you had? I... I don't understand. What aren't you telling me? Look, to be honest with you, I'm not so sure it was a dream. I was back home, and it felt so real. My mom told me to come find her. That's not possible, Peter. She's buried on Earth. We don't know what this thing is. It could be affecting you. You think I'm crazy. I don't know what I think. But I will add it to the list of insane things that's happened to us lately. Look, we just need to get the relic back. All right, Peter. Whatever you say. Hey, Drax. Peter, is the slaughter glorious over there? Spare no gruesome detail. Haven't run into anyone yet. Oh, good. I am less envious now. Rocket, how are the engines looking? Not great, Pete. The old girl's seen better days. Hey, Groot, don't stick your roots in that. Huh? What the hell? Those are pictures of... This is more tomb than warship. And we're sure they're actually really dead, right? The Kree are a technologically advanced species, but science cannot defeat death. Those glyphs are Kree, but I can't make out what it says. I can. Much better. Bridge. Hala's gotta be there. Which means that's where the relic is. Hala would be expecting a direct attack. We need to find a way in there without being seen. Power diverted to access way. 36 stasis pods now offline. Equilibrium terminated. Uh, whoa. My bad. They can't get any debtor, I guess. Hey, Kamora. I'm game if you are. Perfect. Lead the way. Keep moving and stay quiet. Oh, you're the one who's talking. Shh, what did I just say? Someone has deactivated the stasis pods. I'm your weapons. We must find them. They cannot be far. Keep moving! Did you hear that? Move! At the end of the corridor, be swift!
do not worry, sweet one. You shall be back by my side soon. Once we return home, the process can begin. Few survive an encounter with me and return for more. Peter Quill. It's pronounced Star-Lord. One more step and she dies. It will be easy to... Remove her head. Do not test me. Get that thing off her neck. Very well. I cannot lose my son again. You will not take him from me. I have been searching for so long. No one will stand in my way. I lost someone too. Someone I loved. I am sorry. But this is much larger than a single life. Thanos eradicated my people. Destroyed my planet. Now that you have killed him, the Eternity Forge will be our salvation. You have no idea what this means to me. To the Kree, our rightful place in the stars shall be restored. I know what it's capable of. It let me relive a memory with my mom. It can do so much more than that. You really do not know how this works, do you? You said you lost your mother. Would you kill someone to bring her back? No. I'd never do that. I thought as you once did. Until everything was taken from me. Billions of Kree have died. Bringing them all back will require many sacrifices. I will not rest until we have conquered every star system in the galaxy. Starting with you. with me, Peter. Oh, 
Does PDQ have a boo-boo? Tell that was to walk it off. Oh, no. I am Groot? I don't know, buddy. I hope so. Hey, guys. This is your fault, Green Witch. You allowed him to die. As if you could have done any better. Either of you. Yeah, go on. Blame the guy who rescued you. Peter? Peter, no! I'll give you some time to say goodbye. You know, your mom would smack you upside the head she saw you moping over her like this. Quills ain't no little babies. The hell do you know, mister? You don't know my mom, and you don't know me. I know a lot more than you think. Ah! You better pull it together, boy. Cause I'm the closest thing you got to family right now. Now let's get. I don't want to be on this planet any longer than I have to. What the hell are you? What? What? <laughs> well, ain't you got a scrote on you? The name's Yandu Udanta. Your ma wrote me into taking care of you if something ever happened. Something happened. Now, you can come with me easy. Or am I gonna have a fight on my hands? Won't do you much good. You're a bony little scrap of nothing. I can take you without needing to lift a finger. If I go with you, what's in it for me? Not being alone, you'll be part of my crew. So what's it gonna be? Alright. I'm ready to get out of here. I trust you. That a boy. Come on. Let me show you your new home. Don't worry, my little Star-Lord. I'm here to help you. It'll be all right. Mom. Is that really you? You'll understand soon. Mom? Come find me, Peter. I'll be waiting for you.
<clears throat> this thing recording? Okay, so, yeah. I thought once Thanos was kaput, we'd have to change our name. Heroes of the Galaxy. Partyers of the Galaxy. <laughs> yeah, but the thing about this place? It never stays guarded for long. As soon as Hala found out we had the Eternity Forge, we shot up to Numero Uno on her murder list. Yes, dying hurt. A lot. What kind of question is that? Mm, I am Dad, Groot. you know what, buddy? Why don't I feel these questions? Since we're putting this on record, it was a brilliant idea to pawn off Thanos. But I ain't thrilled those idiots at the Nova Corps ended up with them. You see units pouring out of my ears? Cause I don't! Peter ain't a bad kid. Bit of a whiny pushover on his best days. Soon as he showed up at my hideout, I could tell he got himself in some kind of trouble. The Kree ain't folks you want to mess with. I thought I could keep my distance from Nebula. Avoid a confrontation with her. I was wrong. Once she found out what the Eternity Forge could do, everything it could do, there was no stopping her. I'm gonna use an Earth analogy here, so just bear with me. The Guardians, we're like the Beatles. I'm John, Gamora is Paul, Rocket is Ringo, Drax is George, and Groot, well... Well, Groot is just Groot. It's, it's, it's not a perfect analogy, all right? <laughs> we yell, sure. We fight. But damn, do we make beautiful music. I just hope I can keep the band together. Or this galaxy doesn't stand a chance.